In today's video, I'm going to try and finish one of the two sets that I'm currently creating in my shed. If you want to see all of my previous work on the shed, go check out my YouTube shorts and my TikTok. Today though, I want to have this set done by 3 p.m. to film a different video. It's currently 4 a.m. So we'll have just over 11 hours to get this video done. Let's go. Oh my God. It is so hot in here. What? You're, you're set to 60. Why is it 80 in here? So now there's two pieces of trim here. One is a little tiny one, and the other one is the one that we need. Now, it's hidden behind all of this stuff, so we're gonna have to move good old Bessie out of the way. Do not crash. We made it. We're out. Parked. Now that we got the trim moved out, all we need to do is uh, steal my dad's nail gun and the battery I bought him for Christmas. Uh, don't tell him I did that, please. So after measuring this out, it comes to 87 and 3 quarters inches from there to there. So now what we need to do is for that measurement onto this, cut it, paint it, install it, and then we're done. at these and I think they'll look better spray painted black in there so I made this just so I don't get my grandma's car all spray painted that's the only reason just don't I know I didn't need to go through that work but it's here so we're gonna use it so ju just just don't okay thank you So after I started, I noticed a lot of overspray, and I at that point was very happy that I decided to set up this makeshift painting enclosure. On top of this, after putting on the first couple of layers of paint, I noticed the paint fumes were getting really bad. And so I decided to put on a mask. Why I didn't open up a door, I don't know. I just put on a mask. It seemed logical in the moment, but here we are. All right, I've showered, these have dried, the smell of paint fumes in here has mostly gone away, and now we can move these out and, well, staple them in. Oh, there's no battery. Paint dried, I uh, took the, the sled out and froze my tits off, smacked my ass a bunch, and I think they're dry now and ready to get installed. finished product looks freaking clean and I mean this is probably at most how you're gonna see it so seeing it like this being able to see majority of the trim it still even looks amazing hey guys we got it all set up we actually just finished filming our mr. beast chocolate video okay. so we just tried all chocolate it out um, we threw up some just blankets on the walls and it helped a little bit with the sound just because we had a single microphone right now for out here and it's kind of picking up weird stuff. Uh, lights and table whatever. We didn't stream because the Wi-Fi was so bad but we got it all set up. It was good. Um, should be an easy video to edit just like this one thankfully so yeah. We might as well use this good lighting while it's here. Um, my quality isn't that great, probably. But, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video of setting up this, putting the trim in, which you can't see right now. But the plan, the tentative plan for this is two chairs, like outdoor chairs, because they're smaller and lighter, but they're still comfy, and they don't take up as much space, which will be great for actually kind of creating a set, for, like just chatting stuff here. Um, and yeah, so you'll be able to see the trim then. And maybe a coffee table. It will dress it up as time goes on. But for right now, it works great. We just need some soundproofing of the ceiling because that's not helping. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Go check out this video. Um, this stuff was pretty tasty. Couldn't say it for myself. So yeah, um, 
check it out. Go check out Twitch, TikTok, other YouTube videos. See you guys all later. Peace!